about a year ago, uh, Jill decided that she wanted to do something here with this uh, fireplace and bookcases. Um, like most houses out here that were built in the 80s, uh, they came in here and they put these up real quickly. A lot of the features seem to be uh, present in all these houses out here. So she typically, it was just a typical wood fireplace here um, with an overmantel mirror, some crown moldings and stuff like this that continued the crown across the top. And then there was this basic shelves that were um, open shelving that you can move and manipulate, um, you know, with the little pegs. And then down here were there some horrible melamine doors, um, like the old kitchen cabinets used to be. And so we decided to do something that was a little more transitional, kind of still keeping with some tradition and some contemporary elements. And so we went ahead and we pulled off the old wood mantle and put this um, mosaic tile of glass and stone up here to create some focal point. This here is a paintable piece of, or a stainable piece of poplar that we used and we took a clear across the whole thing to expand the room out and then we went ahead and we did the slat doors just to kind of create interest and also so that when you're using the remote control the um, LED could read there and switch your channels and turn your stereos on and things like this. I liked how this um, fireplace mantle continued straight across to create the first floating shelf in the bookcases and so um, we finished this probably about uh, six months ago and then we just started in the kitchen and so you'll see some kitchen photos here too in a minute.